I'm Marta and this is the Dolls Rescue Channel and this was our first Friday haul of March. Let's get right to it. As you can see, I am so spoiled. Um, Walmart had the Poppy Cheerleader on clearance for $9. Let's just get right to the doll. Isn't she lovely? nine dollars these dolls were 20 i think 23 yeah 22.88 is what it says the full price was when they first came out and there's more but let me show you some of this other stuff first um oh gosh we went everywhere um i needed some things for collabs um and i needed to go to Hobby Lobby, which didn't have what I needed, so we went to Joann's. That's always dangerous, two fabric stores. And I needed some little bitty print. Um, at the Dollar Tree, they had, I'm looking, oh, that's it. No, it's not. I just had some dust on it or something. No problem. I'm still looking for another one or two or five of these silver boxes. These are what I send the mini dolls in, the mini blice in after I customize them and get their stand, Darren gets their stands and stuff made. It's a nice size box and I got a gold one. Not quite as large, but something larger goes in those. I'm gonna need these for um, October. Cute kind of macabre color, I don't know. Um, I got these for a collab coming up, little jars. You can put like um, parsley or peppers or um, food colors, some liquids and write the word poison on it or potions. Darren's getting ready to garden, so he got some uh, seeds. Um, Dollar Tree does have seeds and they are four for one dollar. They also have these. Aren't these adorable? These are going to be so cute for AG dolls and Blythe dolls. They're like the perfect size. I'm wondering if they're too big for the mini, a uh, midi Blythe. They're, they're too big for the mini, but they might be okay. And, you know, I'm sewing a lot, so... I needed another pair of glasses easily reached. Uh, Darren bought these dowels we use for the stands that Darren makes, the doll stands. Not only have they changed the size, not every stick in the pack is the same size anymore. So he goes through a lot making those doll stands and then he sands them and sizes them and uh, red, uh, red ribbon because it's still 47 cents. And I guarantee you, you're going to see that at a dollar coming up real soon for another collab coming up. And March is my birthday month. And Darren buys me something every day and surprises me. It's usually like on my computer. I got a thing of cookies. Oh, the first day I got a great big bag of Hershey's Kisses with almonds, my favorite. Um, and just fun stuff, like, um, look what he made. This is, this is so cute. It's a little Easter rabbit, chocolate Easter rabbit, and it holds, which way does this go? This way? Nope, the other way. The other way. It holds a Kinder Egg. How cute, oh, I had it in there. How cute is that? Well, doggone it. He said that there's <coughs> another Kinder Egg that doesn't have an edge, and we need to try that. I think this might hold like plastic eggs too, like the colored plastic eggs. And Carrie, yours is on the 3D printer. I'll be getting that off to you. For those of you that don't know, um, Carrie at Ink Pads Play Pad opens the Kinder Eggs quite often and she buys the whole, any series that they have. She's so cute. Anyway, so it's birthday month. Look what I got for two of the days. We found these in Columbia, which is a much larger town than we live in. We drove a while to get there, but that's all right. I don't get them today. 
I get them throughout the month. But I'm excited. And that one's in. Oh, no, something in there. Oh, so several people are building um, doll houses. I have a doll house. I actually, I have two. I think I have one, one 12 scale and then I think a smaller scale. I'm going to have to look. They are from when I was 16 and a boyfriend bought them for me. And I'm thinking I'm going to get them out and I might have bought this. Thinking about either a, what I'm really thinking about is a diorama room. But isn't that cute for the um, mini blouse? For a little chalkboard. Thought that was cute. Dollar Tree. You have to be careful at the Dollar Tree though. Now everything is a dollar twenty-five. That's a 25% increase in price. That's a lot. And when you get to the cash register, if you have four items, or uh, yeah, four items, that's one more dollar than it was. But speaking of miniature and rooms and all that, and mini blice, they had these. Okay, these were worth $1.25. I think they're adorable. And, um, Darren could 3D print these, but it takes hours and electric and filament. And for $1.25, we bought that. Actually, I got two. Somebody's probably going to see these in their um, little boxes when they get a mini black from me. And I got a couple more boxes because I need to get ready. I need to get four ready. Um, oh, and dollhouses. This is a bit big for the minis but maybe cute for a black. I just thought it was cute. I liked it. I bought it. It was worth $1.25. Oh, here's more of the seeds. Yum. And toothpicks, the ever, ever uh, popular. I'm going to put uh, one of my dolls hair up in like um, 50s style. Not really a beehive, but up. And I thought I might try these, or they show to you this way, self-stay rollers, and then put hair on either side so you can't see it. Will it work? Well, come back and see. I'll be showing that. Um, Habe, labe. I love these. I bought some uh, year before last. These are bly size baskets. Uh, six. For $6.99, that's just a little over a dollar a piece, but they were 40% off, which I thought was a great deal. Uh, but I picked up some patterns. Anytime I see those free patterns, and I have a lot of friends that have uh, the Reborns. This is for a collab. Uh, these are for upcoming collabs. I went specifically for this ribbon. We went to Columbia for the ribbon. We went, oh, that's right, we did. That we dollar went. ribbon cost me a whole lot more than that. No, I got this at um, first place, by the way. I'm yeah, just teasing. We left here to go get it. Yeah, I see what you're saying. I thought you meant drove, never mind. Still tired from yesterday. Oh my God, this is how my husband is. So I'm standing in line to get fabric cut. And like I said, it's birthday month. And he's got his hands kind of funny, but I didn't think too much of it. And my hands aren't big enough to show this, so I'll just show one. I'm not even sure I can get one in there. But he's got his hands like this. And I said something about, oh, and I have to run back and see about beads. I need some beads. And he said, he did his hand like this, only he had like all of the little tiny, these are smaller than seed beads. I think he had five or six in his hand. They were on sale. They were 50% uh, off, so it was a great buy. So I went over to look for the colors that um, I was thinking about getting, and they had some on clearance. I should have had one of these open to show you. I don't know if you can see. These are like hognose. I don't know if you can see it in here, but they're they're like a oval button. Yeah, like an oval button, but they look like a pig nose to me. But I really like them. But I thought these would be really cute and different 
on uh, Blythe outfits for um, beads. They're just different. And look at all the colors. I love this incandescent. I love these. These are just, these are the coolest. My favorite. So I got those. And they didn't have the black fabric I was looking for um, at... Um, Joanne, or at uh, Hobby Lobby, so we went to Joanne's. I've been needing some small print um, fabric, Easter fabric, and I found this, and I really like it. And it was 40% off. In fact, I think Alexandra 404 Creative made me a dress uh, last year, year before, out of that fabric. And I got my orange and my black. And they had this cute little Star Wars, and I got to get somebody a Happy Meal put together with Star Wars. So I bought that. But look at this. Isn't that adorable? You know, when I first saw it, I thought, oh, yeah, that'll do. Um, that'll be fine <laughs> um, for the mini blouse at Christmas. And the more I look at this fabric, the better I like it. There's so much you could do. I mean, that would be, that would be a cute Christmas tree. Um, oh, what do you call it? The little skirt, the little rug, Christmas tree skirt under a dollhouse tree. I really like it. And they had patterns on sale. I might have gotten a few. They were, you know, you, they, they're not doing it like they used to. They used to have it once a month, I think it was. They had simplicity, and then they also had... Um, McCall and they do or every other month they do Simplicity McCall Simplicity McCall well they only had the Simplicity and the um, ooh that's for somebody specifically and the um, Quick Sew on sale but I bought, I bought some and then Darren said do you want to get some for collabs and stuff I'm like oh man so I went back and I got more this is for someone specifically. I thought this was a really cute outfit. I don't have many 18-inch uh, uh, doll patterns. And I want to take that and lengthen the arms, the legs, the skirts for my 24-inch Amaya. And then see how they fit my 32-inch Elsa. And I got some Barbie. And the, these are the same. That's why I'm... Uh, just showing you the front one. This is uh, 18 inch. I really like that. But what I, I think what catches my eye is the tie dye. That's how they pull you in those cute prints. And this I thought was cute with a little romper. I really like that dress. And I got more than one of those. I got some of this for Happy Meal. Uh, this is for someone specifically. That's a real easy pattern. It's got your skirt, your top, your pants and a little dress and they're all easy they're an easy easy pattern uh, and then I think these are the same I wanted more of these because it has the pants the jacket the hood the dress the top the coat uh, and the jacket I like this that's cute uh, but they only have three patterns so I bought them so let's get back to the dolls let me set these over here oh and this is the same thing for Darren. Oh, it's so frustrating when they change such nice things. So they had Poppy for $9. They actually had four. We might have bought more than one. I was going to get two. And Darren's like, you know, you should, you should really get another one. Um, the last one... The um, box was just like, it was like somebody took a sledgehammer to it. It was like a window, you know how it's pushed in. So we did not buy her. I probably should have because I'm going to take one out. And the doll did not look damaged. But those were $9 a piece. I'm really tickled. I'm going to open one. Uh, Poppy is probably, uh, you know, it's like the life dolls. Today, this one's my favorite. Tomorrow, that one's my favorite. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's my favorite. No, that's my favorite. And then they had, I have one of these, but I don't have an open one. They had the Amaya Rain with the blue hair, thrilled to death, loved the shoes, 
cute outfits. Love the hair, love the hair, love the hair. So I'm going to get to open one. Okay. Yay, I saved it. So I went, we went shopping, and I told Darren at one point, I said, you know, we're really getting a lot of exercise because we parked, we didn't park at the door. We parked kind of back because we also had the buffet at Golden Corral. It was so good. And I said, you know, we're getting a lot of exercise. He said, I know I am taking my wallet in <laughs> my pocket. Thank you for watching the Dolls Rescue channel. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe.